Welcome, I'm from Amazon Alcatel 3X from 2020 and today I'll show you how to bypass the Google verification on this device. Now, you're gonna see soon enough that the device is locked, but straight off starting with the process, you want to, number one, change the language to any kind of other language that uses different keyboard. So as you can see, basically anything from here downwards will work, so Greek, Russian and all those other languages are just fine. From there, Let's progress to the setup as you would normally do by basically skipping everything and getting to the locked screen. As you can see, this is the page where I can verify the uh, well, the phone with the pattern that was previously set. Uh, try to remember that there is a pattern right here, at least for me. Uh, this is one of the ways that we're gonna basically bypass this. So right now it's a pattern. I'm gonna tap at the bottom to choose Google as the unlocking method. From here you wanna tap on the field and when it brings up keyboard, hold the globe icon. This will bring up the two languages. So let's switch it to QWERTY. And as you can see the keyboard changes. Let's hold the icon again and go to language settings right here. Then choose add keyboard. And from here, choose any option that just doesn't have an arrow. So I'm going to go to the first one and then tap on add. And from here, you want to go back to the first page and choose your language that you want to use. For me, it's going to be English. So let's switch to that. And from there, again, we're going to progress back to the locked screen. And again, let's hold the globe icon, go to language settings, add a keyboard. And from here, you wanna look for an option with an arrow. As you can see, there is Albanian for me with an arrow. So that's what I'm gonna tap. And from there, you wanna choose three dots and go to help and feedback. And from here, select use Morse code. If this option isn't here, just type it in here. And from there, tap on play button, tap on three dots and go to watch later and this will open up Chrome. So from here, let's accept and continue. And no thanks, we don't want to sync. And tap on the search bar on the top and you wanna to navigate to hard reset.info slash bypass. So. Like so. And from here, scroll down and tap on the settings. This will in turn open up our settings on the phone. And from the settings, you wanna scroll down to security, then tap on the screen pinning, enable it, lock device when unpinning, and choose a method uh, of well, protecting your device. So like I said before, we had a pattern set and like I also mentioned, it is kind of important to the process. Uh, so we had a pattern. I'm going to now change it up to something completely different. Now you don't actually have to change it up if you, for instance, your device can be unlocked with a pattern. You can also set it up if your device cannot be unlocked with any kind of code and just requires Google account. I can still set up pattern or whatever else you want. So I'm going to go with a pin for this time. And my pin will be one, two, three, four. So that's what I'm gonna set. Stop on next and then confirm it. One, two, three, four. Okay, and it's set. Now I'm not gonna bother adding a fingerprint. It doesn't really matter here. So from here, what you wanna do is simply hold the power key, restart the device. So let's wait for it to boot back up. Now, because we have set a pin, uh, it will be required multiple times throughout the setup. You will see what I mean. Okay, so as you can see, uh, when the device boots back up, it starts off by being locked. So we will need to put that pin that we have set. One, two, three, four. And from here, simply progress through the setup.
and as you can see it's telling us to verify not pattern but pin this time around so basically the pattern got overwritten with a pin that we have set uh, to the settings so all we need to do now is put one two three four tap on next and that basically unlocks the device so from here i'm gonna skip logging in and basically skip as many things as i can so the device is basically unlocked but i would still encourage you to perform a reset of it through settings um, I'm gonna quickly finish it up and show you where it is, uh, but I'm just not gonna go through it. Uh, it would take uh, unnecessary time. So, skip, finish. Okay, so once you're on the home screen, simply go to settings. And from settings, scroll all the way down to system, reset, and choose factory data reset. And again, tap on reset phone and this will in turn remove any kind of leftovers from the previous account and fully unlock the device. Um, so that is just to be super safe. But that is basically how you would bypass the Google verification on this device. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.